You've heard undoubtedly of what has happened to a level 100 students at the KNUSD, especially as you've been at the uh, Ministry for Gender, Children and Social Protection before. You've heard of that situation at the KNUSD, six uh, people gang raping this poor student. Uh, is there a rape culture of, sh of sorts creeping into our universities and the levels of violence that, that we're seeing? I mean, where is it coming from? What do you see? How do we stem the tide of saying? Yeah, I mean, um, my, my son called me very late and was telling me about the Twitter storm yesterday and, um, you know, and the discussions that were going on um, on Twitter and asked me to join. So I, I was able to um, read and um, it's it's been there. It's been with us. It's getting worse due to social media an increase in the porn access to porn. Mm. by even minus, you know. Is, is there a cultural action. element to it? Is there a cultural element to it? Yes, there's a cultural element to it. There's an economic element to it in terms of poverty, and there's a social element to it in terms of exposure, exposure to social media and um, the, the lack of uh, certain restrictions. Um, so um, all this is uh, coming up, and... Um, there also a lack of um, adequate structures to address rape, to prevent rape, and even to address rape when it occurs. And this is something we have been advocating for. We now have the Domestic Violence Act, and there may be a need to um, extend it to um, tertiary institutions and to ensure. University of Ghana has a sexual harassment policy, but we need to go beyond that because there is a creeping culture of um, impunity um, that is, 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 that is occurring because we are not even able to get um, prosecution. When you even look at the conviction rates, they are very low, below 3% conviction rate. So the law is not even acting to deter people from um, um, committing rape. Most of the time, sometimes it's even settled out of court right. and what have you. And I'm hoping this uh, fund would or some of some resources will be used to go into um, even acquiring um, equipment, modding equipment to be right. able to detect. At this point in time, why do I need to take my underwear to court to um, for it to be examined to ascertain whether or not I've been raped? There's equipment. You can do the DNA. You can take samples. You can do a swap. You can take samples, and mm. you'll be ascertained whether um, I've been raped by Kofi or Kwame. Up till now, as I speak, we don't even have basic equipment. Because if I say Kofi has raped me, they can take a swap from me, and they can also take his DNA and um, his blood sample or urine or whatever, and they can ascertain whether he raped me or not. But as we speak now, the police service do not even have that um, equipment. So we need to really do um, a lot to reduce and, uh, and prevent um, rape. It's, it's really sad. And my heart goes out to the lady, and I'm hoping that um, the perpetrators will be... Um, I mean, we... we, we, we...